God dwells in the statue of a man, reflecting himself into that being, perfect worship. God in us being his tabernacle. God manifesting. I have decided to build a house unto my God, a house which the value cannot be measured in gold. It will be a holy house, a house of prayer, a house which all will feel his presence when they draw near. Its foundation is not laid upon sinking sand, but it is laid upon a solid rock that has no beginning or end. My faith in Christ will be the solid foundation. It will be the anchor upon which I build upon. On the completion of my foundation, raising six pillars will be the next mission. For on the blueprint I have, there is a clear vision. The way it should stand is stated on the basis of a solid intuition. The first pillar I will set will stand on the right side. The second also the same, but slightly more on the inside. The third is most important. I will place it near the center. Next to it, I will place the fourth so the two will hold the center. The fifth then will go left, directly opposite the first one. And the same for the sixth, I will set it opposite the second one. The first pillar is virtue, that will strengthen the house. The second is knowledge in God's word and nothing else. The third is most important, that is temperance. The fourth that stands beside and takes time to build is patience. The fifth that is opposite the first is pure godliness. And the sixth on the left side is brotherly kindness. A simple house I build, but it shall be a masterpiece. For the greatest individual thing will be the centerpiece. But without a roof, the house cannot be viewed completely. So on the top of the pillars, I will place my roof, and that is charity. Then will the house be complete, and no guile can enter it. For upon the completion, the inspector will enter in. When he has done his work, the master shall be sitting within. The centerpiece is his place to call home. For in the middle of this house will be a great throne. At the end, the inspector shall place the missing thing. The stamp that seals the certificate of approval, the master will then stay within. Though the house will take time, I will build it. By God's help, I will manifest it. The house I build will show forth the work of Christ. For I will be that house that will tabernacle Christ. Know ye not that ye are the temple of God, and that the Spirit of God dwelleth in you. This is God's house. I shall be God's house. Then we become into the divine nature of God. And then we become a dwelling place for God. Jesus said it that day, you know, that I am in the Father and the Father in me, I am you and you in me. Know how that God is in his church.